Hello, everybody. I'm a TV journalist. I'm from Romania, Europe. Look at me. Look at my face. I might look as healthy as every person in this room or who watch this transmission, but I have only one lung because of tuberculosis. I had one of the lightest form of tuberculosis, yet I lost a lung, and this happened in an European country. I went through nine months treatment, but I fully understand those who give up the treatment, who abandoned it. I took 16 pills every day. My articulation hurt so bad that I was forced for months to get down from my bed on my knees and on my elbows every day for months during the treatment. The pain is still there, stays with me forever, but now it's bearable. My skin turned orange at the time. I had the easiest form of tuberculosis. There are two worst, which the treatment causes side effects like hallucination or making people deaf forever before finishing the treatment for tuberculosis. Now, imagine somebody who lives for one day from another and tell me a reason to convince this person to carry on this painful treatment. Living simply is not enough because the treatment makes you want to die every day, several times per day. The bacteria spreads through the air. No one is protected. We don't have a new vaccine since 100 years. We had developed medicines for tuberculosis in the <clears throat> 50s. Since then, two new medicines are born, and this is in the time when, for instance, for Ebola, we had a vaccine in one year, and for HIV, we have tons, uh, tons of medicines. Now, think, bacteria doesn't discriminate, but governments and research do. We need new drugs more efficient, with less side effects. We need a new vaccine effective for life, because TB is, uh, TB is the first infection killer at global level, although the tuberculosis is completely curable. This should be the UN declaration in September, a new vaccine, new medicines. And TB goal, it's very nice, but without political commitment, it's not reachable, no matter what society, uh, civil society will do, or doctors, or the UN Stop TB, or World Health Organization, no matter what we are doing. Without political commitment and the proper finance, financing for the, from the government, and TB will remain a simply nice <coughs> idea. We need this new vaccine, we need these new medicines, because we are living in a time when the vaccine that exists for 100 years is effective for only three or four years during the childhood. Thank you. Thank you very much.